So this is the removal bit. When you're removing, downward motions to get rid of the bulk. Never go up towards your cuticle. You always go down. And then to get to the side, when you're going down, you're using the middle belly part of the bit. Okay? You don't, you're not using it down here because that has a sharp edge. And here, the tip, this is better for the sidewalls and the cuticles. Okay. This type of bit is a carbide bit, so it has a lot of teeth, and you never want this to go on your natural nail, because okay. it will eat through it like Swiss cheese. Weird analogy, <clears throat> but okay. It's way too harsh. So you only do it, use this one to remove, like, your thicker gel. When you're going down with these types of bits, you want it to go at the strongest speed. Because you need speed to debulk because it has a lot of teeth. So you, if you don't have enough speed, it's going to be really slow and you'll start to feel like a burn. So never keep the bit in one spot. You always keep it moving. I don't know. I think this one goes pretty high. So you turn it on here, and then to get more speed, you just press. This one doesn't have numbers, so this is a good speed for this bit. And then if you need to go switch, reverse, or forwards, you click here. On yourself, you're going to want to go in reverse. If it's making that sound. See? Strong. Well, not strong, but like even long strokes. Careful that you're not going to get the, your, this bit on your natural nail. Like casting director, but for the entire production. So then what does the casting director do? Make sure. Like now I've gotten to there. Yeah, and you have you have structured base. Wait, look. You have structured base on here, so it's colored underneath, so you can tell what's your natural nail and what's the base. So you just kind of want to debulk this because this is like a month grown out, and now all the weight is going to be down here towards the tip and you want it to be up here. So you have to yeah. shave a lot of this down. Okay. See how you're like just throwing it onto here? This one spot is like much, much thinner now than the rest. You're going to create a hole and you're going to be hitting your natural nail. So you need to start using the tip of that. Keep it flat. See, you're coming in. Well, I'm having a hard time not shaking. Like, I need something. I need my hand right here. Like, I just, I don't have a steady enough hand, I feel. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing pretty good. And then can I show you how to do, get the, the opposite side? You turn, now keep your hand straight, but you're turning this other hand, and you're going to go up. At an angle. Well, you're not going up this way, you're going up this way. Why does it look so skinny? Oh. <laughs> Why do I keep buying the wrong size? Oh no. Oh my god. Okay, no. Hold on. I'm just a little silly goose and I didn't fully read this. Bob the Builder could never...
Okay, so I finished putting it together. It took me forever. It was annoying and now this one side won't lift. I don't think I put the metal bar in correctly, but I don't. I'm not gonna fix it tonight. I'm so tired. Um, I just took my sister's chair because <laughs> she's not here, so I'm just gonna use it while she's not here. I have my Logitech. Logitech? I don't know how to say it. I'm sorry. But it lights up and it's really pretty and it's great. I love it. Um, I have this keyboard set that has the cloud armrest. I will put it in the description. Um, my laptop, which I need a case for, is on a stand that I got from Target. And I got this monitor, I think at Best Buy for really cheap. Um, and then I have this like acrylic stand, a little computer cleaner, my spin drift, um, this little shelf I got at Target for five bucks, and my little Rikuma light. It still needs some adjustments. This is just like the first, you know, look through, go around. I need to hide all of these cables because they're pretty ugly. Um, and this is just some stuff from Amazon that I got that I think I'm gonna show you now. These are just my <laughs> Hello Kitty headphones. So I definitely need to get something where I can like hook them down here because that would be very clutch. Guess I'll just put them there. Uh, okay. Oh, I got this case for my camera, which is great. I saw a TikTok of this girl who used a clear binder and put all of her swatches of all of her colors in this. So it's just like a book that's tiny and easy. And it looked really smart and chic. And I was just like, oh my God, that's so much better than those stupid little swatch sticks that are on a ring. They're annoying. I like being able to see a bunch of colors at once. So I thought this was a great idea. What else? Oh, I got these little cable ties that are pink because I have so many cables. And this shelf is what I'm gonna put all of my gear and all of like my shop stuff. And I need to organize it and I just have so many cables so I thought this was a good idea. No way I can label them. I got some bubble mailers and then this is a big tray for charms that I can't wait to use and show you guys. Anyway, that's it. I'm gonna call it a night and maybe plan out my rest of my week and my posts. Follow me on Instagram, right there. It's gonna be right, right there. Follow me, please, thanks. Okay, so I got some more stuff from Amazon that I wanted to show you guys because who doesn't like a haul? So I got this pink cord holder. I got this Hello Kitty um, phone holder for the car. Very excited. There are a lot of Hello Kitty car accessories on Amazon that I will have to collect slowly over time. And then I got this strawberry um, they call this tissue paper for orders it was really cute not too expensive uh what else i got two more boxes of beetles tips for nail swatching because i got that portfolio book for swatches that i showed you before i also got this nail board nail display i'll take it out of here and i'll put it together and i'll show you I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I know I need to display more nails, like nail art, so I got that for that reason. I got these like swatch little tiles for glitter. 
And then I got a headphone stand 